Thanks for joining us this Tuesday evening. I'm Christy Casciano. I'm Jeff Kulikowski. We're almost a week into phase three reopening, but it's still a no for malls in New York State, including one of the biggest in the nation, Destiny USA. As the governor keeps food and retail tenants inside the mall closed, News Channel 9's Andrew Donovan shows us the pushback the governor is getting from other elected state leaders. We used to have 15 bar stools and these tables a little bit tighter. Last Friday, Neil Patel's world of beer was empty as restaurants outside the mall reopened with phase three. It's almost laughable that you have a two million square foot facility and say that there's there's not enough space. Mike Thies's university sports shop is still closed weeks after the rest of retail opened with phase two. Uh, it's just been a, a very frustrating process and there's no no transparency as to what's going on. Today their mission got the support of three assembly members who praised the governor through the pandemic until now. Do you feel the mall shutdown is an abuse of executive order? I don't know if it's an abuse. I think everything that you look at uh, relative to an executive order, someone could come forward and say you're overstepping. It's too much. I'm just saying give us clarity. Malls aren't only closed, but they're left out of all reopening plans. Today's gathering outside Destiny USA mirrors similar events outside Walden Galleria in Buffalo and Crossgates Mall in Albany, all owned by Pyramid. On the malls, I get their point and we're looking at that. The big if there is if you follow the rules, right? Calling out the governor is rare for Democrats, but even as legislators, they may have limited influence on a governor who's managed the pandemic with mostly executive orders. You do have some influence if you get enough of a groundswell and you're making sense. Destiny USA could open as soon as the governor gives the go-ahead. In fact, the mall was ready for phase two with a requirement for shoppers to wear masks and plenty of reminders to social distance, including the very decked out escalator. And store owners remind us that there's a security force that could enforce social distancing. Live at Destiny USA, Andrew Donovan, News Channel 9.